Looking for something to do this weekend? Well, there's always something to do at Avenida Houston. From dining to live music and even sporting events, you'll never get bored. Yeah, speaking of sports on the Avenida, BBVA Compass Stadium is just around the corner. And joining us now from the Houston Dynamo is defender Jaleel Anibaba. And from the dash is forward Janine Becky. Hey, guys. Hey. hey. Thanks, Thanks for having us. Oh, my gosh. We are so excited you made time to come here. For fans who have never actually been to a game, describe what they can expect. Obviously, it's going to be hot. It's hot, <laughs> first and foremost. But in all seriousness, you know, a good, good atmosphere from our fans. Um, we try to put a good product on the field, so an entertaining game, hopefully. Awesome. Now, um, when people actually do come, and it is hot outside, and they're exploring the Avenida, it's right around the corner from Avenida Houston and everything. Even though it's hot, the excitement that's on at the game, there's food, there's music, there's fun, right? So how do you guys cheer on the crowd or get the crowd pumped up? And how do you get out there and have uh, your energy to play on the field? Yeah, I think um, people get excited when we're performing well. So the Dynamo have had a great season. We've picked it up in the last couple games. So uh, it's, it's, it's exciting for our fans. And we've given them something to look forward to. And you know, when we score a goal, they get excited. And keeping the ball out of our own nets good, too. <laughs> What about fans for the opposing team? Do they ever successfully psych you out? Because it seems like retaining focus might be a bit of a challenge for a regular person like myself. Pros like you guys, maybe uh, not so much. I mean, that's the best part about playing at home. We have our home fans behind us. Um, you know, they're always cheering us on. No matter how many away fans there are in the stadium, you know, it's all about the orange in the stadium. And that's, that's what you know, keeps us going, fuels us, and that's the best part about playing at home. And do you guys have a favorite memory from playing at home here in Houston? That's a hard question. There's so many. Um, probably our two opening games the last two years. We've won both of them with big crowds, so really exciting. Awesome. It's got to be such a rush. Yeah, definitely. So I understand we're going to play a little bit of a game. We have a couple people from the mall who huh? are going to come on up. So. Come on up and learn some tricks. Now, you, go. guys, you guys Here got go. into... Um, Playing soccer by what? Learning to juggle a ball? Is that right? Is that is that how you started? Yeah. yeah, it's one of the skills you learn as yeah. a kid, for right. sure. Okay, so, so this is Miguel and Linda. Welcome hello. to Houston Life. Okay, so I believe we're gonna teach them some fancy footwork. Because okay. my shoes are not gonna be. A, you were just saying, Steph, look at your shoes. You are not gonna be. I will try, but I think you two are gonna be a lot better. Plus, you're gonna win some tickets. So let's uh, let's let's learn. Let's okay. learn how to juggle. Um, juggling. Do you wanna you wanna try it? Yeah. Okay, <laughs> sounds good. So all you're really going to do is you're going to try to pull the ball up and keep it up like this, if you can. Try. If you have let's to start go, with your hand, you do that. Too. Too. Oh, yeah, nice. Yeah, yeah. Keep going. There you go. Now, you guys you have go. a game coming up tomorrow <laughs> night. Is that right? Yeah, we play tomorrow night. Okay, Correct. excellent. And Linda, do you want to try? Your, your next game is coming up, and it's 90s night, right? Yeah, Sarah Pepper, night. Uh, we were on the radio with her this yep. morning, and she was like, I'm going, and they're bringing back the fanny pack. So. August 13th. Perfect. Okay. So how'd you guys do? What do you think? Let's see some more. Do you want to try? Fancy Let's see it. Okay. Let's see it. I'd say you both did a pretty good job. Careful with those beautifully painted nails you got there. Oh, my gosh. Linda has a perfect red, white, and blue nice. pedicure. There you go. Uh -huh. the ball. So okay. cute. That All right. It's fantastic. So we're going to give you guys um, some tickets. One for tomorrow. Uh, one of you all get two tickets for tomorrow night's game, and one of you all get the uh, dash ticket. So thank you guys so much. Thanks for having yeah, us. Thanks, yeah, for, thanks having for being us. here, and everyone needs to get out and watch you guys play. Cheer you on. Yeah, perfect. Jaleel, Janine, Miguel, Linda, thank you so much for stopping by. Awesome. Thank Folks, you. for more information on what's happening at Avenida Houston, just check out AvenidaHouston.com. And here's a quick look at your weekend sports in H-Town. As we mentioned, the Houston Dynamo take the field against the Portland Timbers at BBVA tomorrow night. And the Sugarland Skeeters are taking on the Somerset Patriots tomorrow and Sunday. Now, our very own Eric Ray, who's raising money for the Leukemia and Lymphoma Society, has actually partnered with the Skeeters. And if you guys buy tickets online at SugarlandSkeeters.com and choose to purchase the single game ticket um, for tomorrow night's game at 6.05 p.m., then just enter KPRC in the special offer code box, that's going to automatically donate $4 of your $12 ticket to Eric's LLS campaign. That's so cool. He's doing such a great job, training so hard every morning. Indeed. Now, coming up next, the lovely Sharita Perez will play us to the weekend. Stick around. Thanks.